massive what's going on it's your boy super mc man yo come to fill you in about the competition team two we met yesterday at the drum hold tight dolores man thank you very much um you know you know what i mean I've, I've known you for a little while because of working with um junior and i just want to say thank you for um sort of um accommodating us you know at such short notice as well thank you very much man um enough love from unity network and anything we can do for you please do ask um, yeah, bam, team two, competition, uh, blast beats, um, yo, it was good, met some new individuals as well, very happy with the outcomes of the um, individuals in there, very happy with the outcomes of how the meeting went, really happy with Kit as well, not Kit, the car out of Knight Rider, but the actual gentleman by the name of Kit, um, who's going to be like sort of mentoring the youth through the competition, so I'm really happy about I'm really confident in his ability after sitting down in the meeting. It was kind of like, yeah, this guy, this guy reminds me of me. You know, not like kind of bigging myself up, but you know what I mean? Nah, he's, he's, he's on point, he's on point. So I know that, you know, they're going to really get some good stuff out of it. Um, yeah, I had some notes because I did speak to everybody um, at the competition, but I also had some notes I wanted to give you so you could just focus on a bit more and know what you can really get out of this competition, you know. Big up Blast Beats and not taking anything from Blast Beats and even Unity Network. But, you know, this is about you as an individual and, and you forming your own business, making a product and, and, and getting the gross profit net from the actual business. So, I don't know if some of you really understand that you can make a business out of this, you know, you can make some change. So, these are just some questions I put together for you to ask yourself seriously. Just ask yourself, you know, you know when you're in the room and it's just you and the truth, you can't run away from that. And you really have to just ask yourself, yo, you know, can, am I really taking my uh, music career seriously? So, blam, number one is, since 2013, what is the current net profit, yeah, from the music, art industry, media industry, um, how much money have you made basically since 2013 until now and if you've not got that answer why if you don't know why you know put this down start taking it seriously okay are you on track for where you want to be in the industry you desire to be in are you on track are you meeting the people you're supposed to be meeting are you getting on the shows you want to get on you know are you on track yeah ask yourself the question what is the market there's so many genres out there which market are you marketing yourself to yeah, and are the fans buying your music? You've been an artist now for a little while. I mean, I don't care if you're a bedroom MC, I don't care if you're MC in front of like the social club, the youth club in front of your granny or granddad. Don't watch that. As soon as you sell your product, you're a professional artist. Come on now, someone's taking interest, someone's buying it. So why are your fans not buying your music? Are you marketing it right? Ask yourself the question. If I am a mainstream recording artist, yeah, and I'm doing it all big time and everything, why would I want to work with you? Why am I going to want to take myself and say, yeah, put him on the bill with me? Have you got anything attracting me to your music? Or is there a reason why is your fan base as big as mine? Ask yourself the question so you can start getting the mood. Another one, and this is very important, what is the reason for you doing this competition? Is it purely about the money? Um, if it is, yeah, that's good, that's great. But also, there should be a passion behind it or there should be a cause in terms of you, there's a need in the community, gang violence, you wanna mash it down or something like that. Ask yourself the question because without diligence and determination and a passion, you might be a bit weak and the other contestants might be stronger than you. Last one is, um, no, the last one sort of ties up with the rest. So it's your boy, Super MC. I've got more footage, check it out, check out the footage now. Okay, peace and love. Yeah, one. With um, uh, Blast Beat and he, he goes to different events. In fact, I think on the one on Saturday, he was there, wasn't he? So he, he does his best to kind of give back as he's, as he's uh, taken out. Um, I'll show you one more video and then I'm gonna show you something about a guy called Hydro and then we'll discuss any other questions that you guys have. This kind of breaks down what everything is all about. Yeah, we 
Blastbeat. So what's it all about? Blastbeat allows students like yourselves to set up your own music and multimedia companies. You create business plans, organize your own gigs, and share free original music as part of a world-class online community, Blastbeat.tv. But behind the scenes, that's where your pure cashback is. Um, so, we'll watch something about Hydro. As we are now, and again, please be honest, there is no shame in being honest. Who would still be interested, if you just show me a quick hand, be interested in, in trying to do something like this, work together to put on your own gig? Okay, brilliant. I'm going to give you a sheet. Um, oh, for this video, can we ask questions? Oh, yeah. Oh, in fact, let's do it now. So I'm, I'm jumping the gun. Um, how long does the, what's the duration of the Okay, program? so we are looking at the grand finals will be in 7th of July in London, huh? And then before that, we're trying to give about a week or two weeks for the Midlands final. So that's this year, it. July. Yeah, this year. That's a bit quick, don't you think? Yeah, but it's not impossible. That's really what, what we found that essentially you find a venue, sometimes you can get places for free. Is anyone at college? Yeah, so I was going to say, do you, you the Academy of Music and Sound? That's your front cover. So task one, um, create a mission statement. A mission statement is basically what your company stands for. So when you go to ASDA, ASDA will say, we, are, we believe in giving great quality food for the most affordable prices while supporting local farmers. The local farmers part's not true. But you know what I mean? But that's what they stand for. Um, then you've got to... Uh, set your company goals. What does our company want to do? We want to be able to support a local charity through doing music events um, and uh, break down maybe postcode barriers. So uh, your goals would be put on a successful event, find good artists, this, that and that. So again, like real life, you've got to know what you want to achieve before you can get there. And then it says register a name, think of a, a company name. So all these tasks have points with them. So your bronze, are your basic things that any event or any organisation will need. Then the silver is what makes it look a little bit more special, and then the gold is what makes it creme de creme. So there are silver, bronze, silver, and gold points. And as a business team, that's what you're getting to judged on. So as your regional um, go-to person, every time you set up a Twitter, send it to me, so I can tick off 50 points for you. Uh, we found a lot of artists, I can tick this off for you. We found a venue, tick that off for you. Uh, we found a way to keep, make sure everybody comes by bike instead of by bus, so we thought about the environment, let me know. So I will be co-supporting you through this, but the idea is that everything you need to do is here. Stage one, then stage two, stage three, and stage four. Okay then guys, um, you've just been to the meeting of Blast Beats, um, it's Super MC from Unity Network and you guys have entered in the competition, I think that's great. What were your thoughts of the process, the introduction? I thought it was um, a really interesting way for like young people to uh, get a foothold into the, uh, the music industry, like to get experience and to get contacts in the industry for the future. It's really good for networking and stuff because I'm meeting people that do the same thing that I do. So it's really, really good, I think, for young people. It's a good way to give them um, practice, you know, in the real world. That's what it is. Okay. Yeah. You guys going to make some money then? I mean, in terms yeah. of what you do? <laughs> Possibly. It's, yeah, it's good for us because we want to um, do a business together anyway. We've been thinking about it. So it's a good practice run for us to see how we work well as a team with other people and see, you know, give us experience to be in a business environment and make money. Fantastic. Great. Thanks for coming, you guys. Okay. All the best in the competition. All right. All right. Hi Cheyenne, my name's uh, Super MC, and have you just been in there with a kit of blast beats? Mm -hmm. What did you think of the process in there? Um, I think he introduced how he introduced the whole program was real good. You know what I mean? He broke it down for everybody's kind of abilities, not knowing us like personally and knowing how we can understand bits of information. So I thought that he broke it down really, really well. I've now gained a better understanding of the programme and I am a lot more intrigued in what's to come and what we can produce by the end of it. Having looked at 
examples from the past and how it can be done. I'm just really excited to get working again. Fantastic. Well, I'm glad I really stopped you. And I'm glad <laughs> we got you on board and all the best of luck in the competition. Thank you very much. Right, cheers. <laughs>